the box out. Box it. All right. We are organizing this house. For me, this under. Oh, I got some socks. Oh, oh, the oh, the looking nice. It's all I want. Yeah, those are gonna be for Ava. Uh, and and did you give me socks too? <laughs> I think I did, little guy. Let's see. Uh, yeah, those are for you. Okay, this is nice and funky. Okay, I got some drawer dividers. Got bamboo drawer dividers. Why is she's excited? Right. Yeah, this is my essential oil display stand. Mike, do you want to put this together for me? What? My uh, essential oil stand. Oh, Mike so. is so handy. He can put together anything and can build anything, can't you, Mike? Yes. I even know how to build Lego machines. Yes, he does know how to build Lego machines. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah, these are the toy bins. They're really small, but we're going to make it work. A diaper caddy. What is that? Oh, yeah, This is a lid organizer. Contact paper for the drawers. I also got a bookshelf. Last one. Okay, let's get. Okay, and this is the little um, caddy that I had before. Oh, mama, mama. And it's small, but it does the trick. So I just fit what I can in here. I have more in the... There's that. Oh. One's going upstairs. One's going to stay downstairs. Essential oil caddy. Whoa. Great job, buddy. This was exactly what I wanted. I actually wanted them to go this way, but I couldn't find dividers that were long enough. But this worked because I wanted to be able to just open and see exactly what was what. Mike is doing a great job. Good job, buddy. Okay, so I um, just organized the top drawer and then I put my Steak knives under here, my baster, my mud water mixer. And then I put one of my drawer dividers here. I have my wraps over here, rolling pin, cookie cutters, and here. Um, everything is pretty easy to get to. And down here, I just put a couple of the organizers down here to put the lids into. I have my diffuser, my bread kneader, my Vitamix stuff. Over here, I put another drawer divider, and this is my drawer where I keep things that we t either take every day or that I need to get to if somebody's sick, and so I don't have to go digging through everything. So I have homeopathy, horse paste, nebulizer stuff, um, my beef organs. These ch have changed my life. This changed my dad's life. Sometimes I'll have to. Sometime I'll have to share the story with you. Um, but yeah, and then this the contact paper is so beautiful. But what I got didn't last my, me much at all because it only lasted for the two drawers over at the other cabinet and then half of this drawer. 
And then this drawer, I have my incense in one place, the charcoal bri briquettes right next to it, my lighter, my prism and incense candles, plugins, which I, I only really use these for fall and Christmas. Blessed salt, frankincense and myrrh, or just myrrh. Um, batteries, remotes, checkbook, which we never use. Some rosaries, ball lids, candles, which I usually put in the windows, but Esther would always tear them down. And yeah, just a couple other random things. But oh my gosh, these things. I know it's like not so aesthetically pleasing, but um, I love it. Okay, this is the lid organizer. I mean, it's better than it was before, but I thought they were going to be like standing up straight. I don't know. And they do roll out easily. So I've tried like turning them around. I don't do no, I don't know if I'm doing something wrong or if it's just like a, a cheap organizer. I don't know. Nonetheless, it's much better than it was before, but let me know if you have any tips. And then I do have a pot and pan organizer coming today too. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Holy Trinity, help lead us to the place you have prepared for us. Father, creator of all creation, help us to make our homes like yours. Christ, light of the world, help our homes reflect your light. Holy Spirit, comforter and helper, dwell within our homes and within us. For the health and well-being of our families, for safety from physical and spiritual dangers, for order in our days and homes, for peace when there is chaos, for healing from all wounds and illnesses, for joyful fidelity to our vocations, for the knowledge that we are seen and loved by God, for the wisdom and courage to put conviction over comfort, for freedom from self-pity, for growth in holiness, for our work and endeavors, for gratitude for our many blessings, for strength to do our duty diligently, and without complaint, for generosity for those in need, for the holiness of our husbands, for our husband's employment and satisfying work, for trust during financial struggles, for wisdom in the face of marital disagreement and strife, for our physical and spiritual children, for their purity, for their full growth in virtue and holiness, for their future spouses and vocations. Help our homes to be places of good cheer and warmth. Help our homes to be free of unkind words and actions. Help us to be hospitable through aid, kindness, and comfort. Help us to truly nourish our family members, physically and spiritually. Help our homes to be peaceful places of rest and renewal. Our Lady, Exemplar of Beauty, pray for us. Our Lady, the Homemaker of the Holy Family, pray for us. Our Lady, Mother of God and our Mother, pray for us. Our Lady, Queen of Heaven and Earth, pray for us. Father, who wait at the gate of heaven of our eternal home, spare us, O Lord. Christ, who opened the door to our heavenly home, have mercy on us. Holy Spirit, who gently lead us to our true home, graciously hear us, O Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed this content, please give me a thumbs up. And if you want to see more Catholic content with new uploads every week, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. We'll see you next time. God bless.